A neighbor in need, it's a kind gesture, especially during tough times like we're in right now. In tonight's We Are Open story, ABC 27's Abby Maurer shows us how one business is donating more than one helping hand. Founded in 1979, Keith McNeil Plumbing has fixed a lot of messes, and they've not let the coronavirus stop up their ability to work. It's been interesting because you're seeing a, a, a wide range of customer reactions from some people not caring whatsoever about the, the virus to some being extremely concerned. So it's been interesting, you know, running a business during unprecedented times always uh, requires a little out of the box thinking. They've kept their community giving flowing, recently donating a free meal to a frontline family. I think it's very important to have a positive outlook through, through these type of tough times. And um, so, you know, we're always looking for ways to give back to our community that helps us so much. <laughs> They've also enlisted the help of their employees. Nine-year service technician Elvis Alamon said his elderly neighbor was all shook up when a recent bad storm blew down her fence. One of the windstorms that went through blew the boards down, and with a dog, I needed my fence fixed. So the company came out, rolled up their sleeves, and got to work. Oh, it's awesome. It's an awesome feeling to, to be able to, uh, not just to give back, you know, um, it's, it's very self gratifying to be able to help somebody else, help somebody in need. It made me feel great. <laughs> Absolutely made me feel good. And I don't have to worry about him chasing the rooster next door. <laughs> Using some downtime to leak a little love into the lives of others. In Tallahassee and Havana, Abby Maurer, ABC 27.